Oakview Mall is on the market again. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rob McCartney. I'm Julie Cornell. A listing went up last week after it was acquired two years ago. Stores like Dillard's and JCPenney are still intact, but retail spaces inside the mall are going empty. KTV News Watch Evans Alex McClune is live at the property near 144th and West Center with what's next. Alex? Rob, Julie, not a lot of cars out here ahead of the holiday shopping season, but maybe the next owner has some new ideas in store. Let's cut the ribbon. Three decades have passed since Oakview Mall ignited an empty area of West Omaha. It's seen the highs and lows of retail, but the vice president of NAI NP Dodge might know how to get the masses through the doors again. There's actually a great opportunity with Oakview Mall right now. Thousands have bought into Trenton Maggot's Grow Omaha newsletter, but inquiring about Oakview's price tag is not for the faint of heart. In order to make Oakview Mall vibrant again, either some or all of it will likely be torn down, certainly repurposed. Repurposing like housing. He showed us the main building and south and west parking lots are up for grabs with an unlisted price tag, likely because agents want to see how much buyers are willing to fork over for a space 74% occupied inside. How long has it been since you've been to a mall? Uh, it's probably been, oh, I don't know. I would say maybe once in the last three years. It's no secret we prefer to click an order as opposed to going inside brick and mortars. I'm very anxious when it comes to crowds. Nebraska uh, Crossing has been very popular. It's a lot easier to park, hit 10 different stores, and get out. Thousands live and work around this mall. Getting them to show up will take some imagination and camaraderie from next door. Whoever buys this land also has to jump through a lot of hoops, not only with the city of Omaha, but also the conjoined business owners of JCPenney and Dillard's. Rob, not to mention, this is going to cost a lot of money, likely starting at several million dollars, in case you have any laying around. <laughs> I don't, Alex, but it'll be interesting to see where that bidding starts. Thanks. <laughs> well, the last time Oakview was on the market, it was 2021. It was purchased for $7.5 million by Cohan Real Investment. It's based in New York. The mall opened in 1991 after years of construction.